So my name is Michael Tuchek. I'm a cardiac, thoracic, and vascular surgeon here at Franciscan Health. So I think patients, when they come to see somebody like me, uh, are pretty frightened. And we try to put those fears to rest right off the bat by explaining to them what they're really gonna go through, what their expectations should be, because there's a whole lot of things out there from, oh, my mom went through this 30 years ago. Well, 30 years ago isn't today. So they need to understand things are done a lot differently now, a lot better. People go home in three days after open heart surgery. So we do things differently. And I think patients really expect us to treat them like their mom or their dad, which I literally have done. All my friends, relatives, people come to me and I treat them. If I can't do it personally, I find them the doctor that's gonna help them. And so when I explain to them that I'm gonna tell you what I think I would do for my mom or my dad, they've already asked the question half the time anyway, well, what would you do if this was your mom or your dad? And when we can meet in the middle and find that what I would recommend is what they would really wanna do, then we've come up with a good plan for them to have heart surgery, vascular surgery, whatever it takes. So I, I chose Franciscan for a number of reasons. Yes, they have a vision. Yes, it's a large system. It's nice to work in a system because you get more tools to work with typically, more expertise. You can draw from different hospitals with different experts. But I chose it mainly because this is where I grew up, literally a mile down the road. Uh, I'm a region I'm from the region and I'm proud of that. Uh, so everyone I see, I say, look, you're my peep. I've got to take good care of you because I grew up down the road and some of them know my parents, so if I don't do them well, my parents will hear about it. So I, I enjoy the people here because they're my people. You know, when I started all of this uh, in the anatomy lab and tied that first knot, I knew that surgery was it. And I'm fortunate enough that I can do that every day. Nobody else can do that but certain people like myself. So I'm blessed that I, that I got the education and have the technology and the surrounding staff so that I can put somebody on a heart-lung machine, stop their heart, replace their valve, and they walk out of the hospital three days later feeling like a million bucks. Uh, and, and that's very, very important to me.